Hi there, this is Dabarshi and in this video I'm going to cover the recent updates that went live in Chrome Member. So one of the most significant updates uh, is the feature that we released for organizing files with file categories. So once you click on the files option here, the shelf opens up and then here you have your files where you can see all the files that you have uploaded and now we have added a new uh, option which is called file categories and here you can manage your categories and this is pretty much similar to the group video category when you upload group video you have you can create a category it's exactly the same so you come here to the screen and then click on add new category and then you can give a new uh, you can give a name to your category let's say my category is ebooks okay and then you can assign it to a parent category or you can create a separate brand new category okay, so my ebooks category is created now when I go to files I can upload a file and assign that file to a specific category give the name to the file and then just drag and upload the file here so that's the new feature that has been added apart from that we have done uh, a few bug fixes so let me go to a membership Oh, before the bug fix we have also improved the preview of the membership sites so this preview now appears like this initially it was an image which was kind of distorted now we load the preview in an HTML frame so you can easily check out the actual uh, preview of the site the same goes with the course template so for the course templates also you have the same thing let's go to a course and here when you do the preview you can see the lesson preview of that course template okay and um, the same preview you can see when you are creating a new course so apart from that the bug fix that we have done is with the membership website so now this banner was sometimes appearing on top of this uh, uh, this option you know, on the sidebar on the top of the sidebar and this drop down was appearing uh, below this banner at some point so we have fixed that issue and then we have also fixed a issue on the editor that we use to create lessons inside the courses So let me go inside a lesson. So we had this issue where uh, if you select a specific text and then this inline editor opens up, sometimes this color picker was not working properly. Now this has been fixed. Okay. So these are the updates that went live on Groove Member.